it all grainy now? I don't know what's happening. I can't figure this stuff out. I just don't even know anymore. Is it working now? I don't know why it looks grainy on my iPad, but I hope it doesn't look super grainy. Does it look super grainy to you? Hi. Does it look really, is it? I can't tell. It is. Why is it so grainy? Oh, well. I'm not going to restart it again. So we're all just going to have to do it. <laughs> Take two. I'm sorry if the picture's really grainy. I don't know how to fix that. I'm sorry. Just we'll get used to it, I guess. Anyway, hi. Hi, Sabrina. How are you feeling today, darling? I prayed for you last night. Um So as I was saying before, <laughs> I have been filming this video all day and writing and rewriting and refilming and re redoing and bloopering and tons of bloopers. And this video is going to be more bloopers than a video, even though this video shouldn't have bloopers because it's a very serious video. So I don't even know where I would put the bloopers because it's a serious video. I feel like it would be disrespectful to post the bloopers from this video, but they're really funny. So we'll see. Um, oh, you guys are live, Sabrina. I'm sorry. I didn't know that. Sorry. Hi, Kaylee. Um, you did know it, Haley. YouTube hates us. Yes. I love you too, Amy. So anyway, last night we tried to do live stream. It didn't go well. <laughs> so I said I would come on here again today. And do another one so that's what I'm doing um, this is my video for the day because I'm very stressed and just a big ball of sweaty flustered stress making this video and if you're wondering why I look sick it's makeup and it's for the video and you'll see that later um, that's cool Sabrina yeah we need to talk about all that stuff uh, let's see BPD, I hate you. BPD says, I'm not going to say that online, your real name. BPD says, hey, Shani, you're such an inspiration to me. Keep being you no matter what anyone says. Thank you, BPD bleep. Thank you, <laughs> bleep muffin. <laughs> Are you Jade? picture. Oh, I don't know if you are. Oh, I thought you were Jade. Maybe you're not. Whoever you are, I have to bleep that out. Um, let's see. Oh, sorry. It's my hair clip. Everyone, Haley's like, what's making that noise? Sorry. I didn't even realize I was doing that. This, okay, I'll stop. I'm just kidding. I fidget when I'm stressed. Anyway, so... Oh my gosh, stop it. Delani Fleming said, you're so beautiful, so gorgeous. Thank you. That's very nice. <laughs> Welcome, Megan. Hi, I'm Megan. I'm new. Welcome, Megan. Welcome to the family. You're an official Shani family now. Are you a Shani butt or a Shani vagina? If you live in America, family means butt. If you live in Australia or the UK or I'm sure other places, family means vagina. So, depending on where you live will determine whether you're a butt or a vagina. So, are you a shanty butt or a shanty vagina? What is my life? Um, Lila Survivor said, why are you stressed? Because I am trying to get this video out for tomorrow. Um, that is for National Eating Disorder Awareness Week. And this video is turning out to be really difficult for me to make and really triggering for me to make. Like it is triggering old habits. Like I am, I'm not going to tell you exactly what it is yet because I want you, so a lot of you know already, some of you know. If you follow me on Instagram, see this is why you should follow me on Instagram, you get all kinds of behind the scenes stuff 
of me planning and filming and stressing and stuff. So join me, follow me on Instagram if you want to <laughs> um, witness all that. It's really fun. But you guys know a couple years ago for Nita Week, I did a day in the life of a bulimic. That video is... I think my highest viewed I think I have another one that matches it perfectly um, and I'm making something similar to that but when I made that video when I made day in the life of the bulimic I was bulimic at the time the video that I'm making right now I am NOT what I'm portraying in this video and so it's kind of forcing me to go back to what I was during this time of what I'm gonna be portraying and that's been unbelievably triggering, and I don't, I didn't expect this at all. I, I didn't expect that at all. What's my Insta? Um, my Insta is educating underscore Shani, so go follow me right now. Um, yeah, uh, I don't know. I just, I keep on running into, like, roadblocks and feeling weird about it, and just, I don't know, there's just things that are just, I just, I, it's just putting me back in a very sad place. So I can't wait for this to be over. I'm not going to stop now because now I've got most of it filmed, which was the hardest part. Um, like I literally had to put myself, like I had to take a minute before I turned on the camera every time I filmed a part of this video. I had to take a minute and bring myself back to that place in that specific eating disorder that I was in and my thoughts that went through my head just so that I, it could be, you know, portrayed as real as possible. Um, one of the parts in the video that I'm very nervous about is going to be real. Um, and I'm really nervous about doing it, but I think it needs it. I don't know. That's all. I don't know what to, I don't know what else to say without telling you. Anyway, like flashbacks. Yeah. Kind of. Yeah. Just, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Just being back in that place and being like, Oh, this is why I was doing it back then and I should do it again because it worked like that kind of thing which is scary and stupid and I'm not going to but it just really surprised me like I can't believe how difficult this video has been so we'll see how it goes <laughs> I'll see and if it doesn't turn out if I don't feel like it turns out the way I want it to I'm not gonna post it and I'm gonna not feel bad about that because this is something that's very like hard for me to do and serious and I have to think about my viewers and keep them in mind too and I have to think about YouTube and I have to think about my family and my friends and my husband of course and my own health and stuff so anyway so we'll see if I can figure it out um <laughs> Sabrina Sabrina said I can be your stunt double <laughs> I don't get triggered <laughs> Do it! Come over! Danny is texting me. I'll answer her later. Um, Hall Hallie or Haley? Hallie? M says, do whatever is comfortable. Thank you. Hi, Savvy. We all love you, Shani. That's from Amy. Thank you, Amy, Caddy. Um, I love you too, Chrissy. Rory Bortelho says, it's okay if making this video hurts you. If it triggers you, don't make it. We all want the best for you. Thank you, Rory. And I didn't know it would trigger me. Like, it's probably a good thing I'm doing a live stream right now so that you guys can remind me where I'm at <laughs> and bring me back to earth because I've been trying to call Danny. I literally broke down crying. Literally cried because it took me back to that place. So I tried calling Danny, I tried calling him and calling him, he wouldn't answer, and he just texted and said he's on set, he can't answer. So it's probably a good idea I'm doing this live stream now, so you guys can like remind me where I actually am in life and not back in that place where I was very, very sick and sad and scared and lonely and, oh, it makes me want to cry. And my window's open and it's freezing, so I need to shut that. So I'll be right back. All of you write encouraging words, and I'll be back. I'm kidding. <laughs> but sort of not. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it's cold. I was hot a minute ago. Because one of the scenes... Here, I'm going to tell you. Hold on. 
one of the scenes that I did for it. <laughs> uh, one of the scenes that I did required a lot of, um, oh, I'm so nervous about this, guys. You're going to see lots of my body. Not lots, but you're going to see a big part of my body that I'm so self-conscious. I can't believe I'm going to do this. I'm so nervous. Anyway, there's a part of the video where I am obsessively exercising. And I'm not going to tell you why, but I had to do it five takes because of my sister. <laughs> and if she's watching, she'll know why. <laughs> and we've already laughed about it. Um, it's hopefully going to be posted tomorrow. I'm going to do my, I'm going to work as much as my body will let me tonight and hopefully get it done by tonight. I still have a couple things I need to film outside of my house and I'm kind of stuck at my house. I don't have a car. Everyone around me is busy. So Sherlock Holmes said, marry me, Shani. I would love to, but I'm married already. Even though I never wear a ring. People always will say, I need to wear my ring. I don't, my ring is too big. But I have fake ones that I could wear. Um, <laughs> no, that's okay, BPD. I thought you were Jade. I thought you were someone else because Jade likes to make up funny words like that. I'm fine saying I just don't want to offend like my family. Um, Meg said, I've watched you since day one. I think you are incredible and love and cherished and created by the one who creates nothing but love. You are love and loved. Meg, you're going to make me cry. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, Kaylee says, may you be blessed with the happiest haps of all the time so that you can power through this. We're live streaming on your live stream on Instagram. <laughs> you are. I'm going to pull you up. <laughs> you're about to be on my video or my live stream. Wait, they're not even going to see that. Oh, there's me. What is happening? There's Kaylee. Sabrina, go back to you. <sighs> She's not. She's going to not do it. And this is going to be so delayed. So this is so dumb. I've done this before. This is a bad idea. It's going to be so delayed. Sabrina, go back to you. Oh, okay. This is not. She's going to not do it. There she is! You both are so beautiful. Haley and Sabrina. It's hard to talk when I hear myself talking. You are beautiful. Don't roll your eyes at me, Kaylee. I saw that. You take that back. You're grounded. Yeah, what is the screeching? Okay, this is extremely awkward and annoying. So I love you guys, and I'll talk to you on here. Yes. <laughs> okay, I love you guys. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what that screeching is. That's weird. Anyway, we're back. Okay. Um, okay, anyway. <laughs> what were we talking about? Um, let's see. <laughs> okay. Uh, Taylor Gentry said, or Gentry, I don't know. How long are you going to leave up the Valentine decorations? Are you going to decorate for Easter? I am decorating for St. Patrick's Day, hopefully today or tomorrow, if I can get out. Um, I've already, a lot, like all of my window decorations are down. And you'll see why. Um, and then, yeah, so I'm going to do like, four leaf clovers instead of hearts on the tree and then put St. Patrick's Day stuff because my husband's Irish and it's huge in his family to celebrate that. Um, and then I'll do like an Easter spring 
tree thing. So the whole month of March probably will be, or most of the month of March will be St. Patrick's Day stuff. And then it'll be spring decorations all the way through probably, I don't know. I don't know. May or June, maybe. I don't even know what I'm going to do, actually. I'm sure I'll change it and make it a different type of spring. I don't know. We'll see. Um, yeah, my lips are so dry. I have to put on makeup, by the way. That's what I'm supposed to be doing as I talk to him. <laughs> you got in a car accident? <gasps> Emma, what happened? Yes, you will wear a seatbelt next time. What happened? Oh my gosh. Where's my hair thing? Ah. Um, let's see. Um, let's see. It's actually a really nice day. Our snow is melting and it's so cold outside, but it just smells a little bit more springy, which I love. Um, Dahlia Olive said, my mama hen reminds me of you, Shani. Why? Oh, because I screech? <coughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. People hate when I do that. <laughs> That's probably why. That's probably what you meant. <laughs> um, let's see. I love fat birds, too. Why are we talking about fat birds? Oh, are hens fat? I don't know things. I need to wipe. I hope you can't see my bra. I'm using my shirt to wipe. Ugh. Mm, this is a stubborn one. Savvy broke your toe yesterday? Oh my gosh. Where's Emma's? Emma, what happened? I was on my way home from school and a car did not see us and totally smashed into my friend's car. Oh my gosh. Are you okay? Like, are you okay? I'm lucky I got only minor injuries. How about your friend? How about everyone else involved? Are they all okay? So glad you're okay. Yeah, don't you ever not wear a seatbelt. Or else you'll be grounded too. Yes, everyone's good. Okay, good. Portia says, hey girl, hey Portia. Savvy said I dropped a bottle of unopened vegetable oil on my toe. Ow! That's how I broke it. <gasps> Did you have to go to the hospital? They never can do anything about a broken toe. But they can at least drug you or something. Did you go to the hospital? Mm. I'm gonna text Shannon. I think she would be willing to help tonight. Ow. Um, Gigi and BB said my mom once dropped a frozen full chicken on her toe and broke it. Oh my gosh. Ow. I broke my toe once from tripping on my toe. Um. I love you too, honey bunch, honey boonch, Sabrina. Emma said, my friend's little sister bit her tongue. Oh, that sucks. And I hit into the seat in front of me. Oh, if you'd been in front and not buckled. I've been in an accident just like that, Emma, where I wasn't buckled and I was in the back seat and I hit the seat in front of me. Major whiplash. Oh, Shannon's here. 
Shannon, are you busy? <laughs> I thought I would have a ride today, but I need to, um, I need to go to the dollar store and I need to film. Well, it's okay if you can't. Alicia will be home at seven. I might just wait for her. Um, I might just like work on editing here and then. Actually, I bet my sister could take me after her dinner. Hold on, let's call my sister. She's gonna be on the live stream. She's gonna be so mad at me. <laughs> <laughs> Angela and the Angela Angela you are on a live stream right now Oh I am mm -hmm. hello world Hi um, what are you doing Wanna after? Yeah, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> you guys will see what she's talking about if I ever post the bloopers. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. What are you? Shut up. What are you doing? What are you doing after dinner? Or for dinner? Or before? Or after? I'm very stressed. You told me to shut up. Do you really want me to talk? <laughs> Everyone is saying hi. I don't want to today. <laughs> I'm sorry. She's the sister I told you guys about before that it literally took me five takes. Yeah, five takes of me exercising. And the fifth, what, the third take, I think? Okay, I can tell them this part. So there's a part. I know. I know, hold on, so I can tell them this. So there's a part where I'm exercising and my sister calls me, which I had her do, and we had to do it five times. And on the fourth take, I think, I said, okay, call me back in one minute because I cannot exercise longer than one minute because I wanted to be <laughs> exercising while I was while she called. And so I'm sitting there doing squats, filming, doing millions of squats. My legs were on fire because I'd already done four. This is my fourth take. <laughs> a minute rolls by, two minutes roll by. <laughs> you deserve to work that extra workout. So what you put me through. She totally <laughs> waited longer than a minute. <laughs> so if I can find the part on the video, I hope I filmed. I hope I got my face like being like, when is she going to call? Why is she not calling? Good anyway, <laughs> I was totally doing that on purpose too. I know. I'm like, uh, I can give it another minute. I know, <laughs> and I thought that the whole time. And so I wonder if I smirked or anything. I haven't looked at the footage, but that's all I was thinking. Like, why is she not calling? Why is she not calling? Yeah, <laughs> so okay. bad. Oh man. Uh, what, what was your original question? What are oh, you What are you doing after dinner? Or now? After dinner. When are or you now? eating? When are you eating? Well, we're not going to eat till late tonight because I fell asleep and didn't get dinner. Oh, and then I had to do five takes of something, and that ended up in my dinner making. So <laughs> we're not eating for about another hour. Right now I'm just chilling, just visiting with Sean when you called. You want to take me to the dollar store? Do I want to go to the dollar store? Yes. With who? Me. Mm, I'll have to think about that. Let me think about that. Okay, you mm. call me back and think. Do I have any other choices? Yes. You can also... Like going with somebody else. <laughs> no, Alicia's unavailable. Uh, Jordan's unavailable. I haven't called mom. Oh, you really do need to go to the dollar store. <laughs> no, oh, I, I really do. I it's, really this do. Is not, this is not for the movie. This no. Is for real. <laughs> no. <more. laughs> I would have warned you before if this was for a video. Oh I do my not gosh. know what's going on today. Now I'm going to have to post the bloopers because they're all going to be like, what the crap are you even talking about? What's today, mm. Thursday? Yeah, I can take you. You can? Yep. Yeah. Before or after? After. Okay. For sure after. Is that okay? Is that too late? No, that's perfect, actually. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you. All right. Love you. Okay, call me after dinner. Okay. okay. Love you, too. Wait, wait. When I call you after dinner, I'm going to ask you if we're going to the dollar <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> so I'm going to call you after dinner and say, Sammy, 
Hey, you want to go to the dollar store? That would be right, right? Yes, but we're not going to okay. be acting this time. This time it's for reals. I never know with you. Never <laughs> okay. know. <laughs> okay, love you. Okay, love you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I'm going to have to post them now so that you can see. Dang it. Okay. My sister can take me after her dinner, yeah. So I'll just have her do that. I might just have Alicia too. I don't know. Anyway, okay, let's, um, Jason Gates said, is sunshine outside right now, Shani? Looks like it's shining through your door. It's nighttime where I am. Yes, the sun is out today, and I love the sun. Um, oh, no worries, Shani, don't worry. Everyone's busy today. Everyone is busy today. <laughs> I'm going to get this done, though. You watch. Even if I have to freaking, and I have to do, well, I shouldn't be telling you this because I'll get backlash. Never mind. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid that from now on. <laughs> oh, I am just raw today, you guys, for seeing my feelings, how I'm feeling. Where is my eyeshadow? Where is my bronzer? Did I leave it upstairs? Are you kidding me right now? Here's Savvy says, I've been talking to Alicia a lot on Instagram. Good for you. Uh, Shannon said, what are you going to the dollar store for? I need to get St. Patrick's Day decorations for my tree and my windows. Because it's time. It is March, y'all. Um, mm -hmm. Shannon is part of Danny's family who is Irish. You're not Irish, though. Are you? You could be. Your dad is Irish, right? I don't know how things work. Um, what? Are you trying to get me to rap? What is that, Ken? Ken Tom? It was all a dream. Used to read Word Up magazine, Salt and Peppa. And Heavy D up in a limousine, hanging pictures on my wall every Saturday rap attack, Mr. Magic Marlene Marl. What? Happy new month to you too, Haley. Um, <laughs> Shannon said, I'm just a wee bit Irish. That's funny. Sab. Um, Erica Ahener? Ahener? says, I just want to say thank you. You encouraged me to seek help. I'm now in treatment for Ed Nose. I am so proud of you. That's amazing. Good for you. You guys are awesome. You guys inspire me every day. Notorious B.I.G. rap. I don't, I don't listen to rap, so I don't know. It's not that I hate it. I just would rather listen to other things. The only, I love all music except the one that they scream at you. I don't like scream, whatever that's called. Hearts, hearts, hearts. Um, Ashley K said, I love when a new month starts. It renews my motivation to keep going and trying. It's like a mini new year, literally, LOL. It really is, Ashley. It really is. I love that. Um, Noelle says, do you remember me, Shani? Of course I remember you. How are you doing? I have not written you back yet. I'm a really good person. I am so sorry. I have been out of my mind this week. But how are you doing? I love you so much. Are you moving to Utah? <laughs> okay, I need to get my bronzer. I think it's in my bathroom down here because I did some filming in there. Or did I? Wait, did I? I don't know. I'll be back. Okay, uh, so I'm going to go after I'm done with my makeup, which won't take me long, so now is the time to ask questions or whatever you want to do. Mm -hmm.
Cold where you guys live, huh? That's how it was for us a couple days ago. Olive, AKA Olivia, the lupus girl said, your burping is hilarious. Thank you. I think so too. I love you too, Shannon. Thanks. I like my shirt too. That's my boobs, you're welcome. Um, Ashley says, do you stream at certain times or just whenever you feel like it? I feel like I've been catching them more lately. Well, probably because lately I've been on a better schedule. I used to stream like late at night. Last night I streamed pretty late, but it didn't end up going too well. So, um, if it's on Instagram, it's usually at night before I go to bed. And that ranges anywhere from nine o'clock to... 4 a.m. You never know. But usually it's lately it's been before midnight that I go live on Insta. And then on here, I said I would come live around this time today, so that's why I'm doing it today. So that's it. <laughs> it's a really fun story. Um, Uh, Michelle Martin says, hey, Shani, hi. You have been such a big help to me. I've been having issues with my eating disorder since I was 13. Your videos have helped me get through so many hard times. Thank you. Oh, I love you, Michelle. Thank you for telling me that. I'm so proud of you. Proud of you for talking about it. That's the hardest part. That's amazing. Kaylee. Um... <laughs> Aw, Lila Survivor says, this is a treat. It's often night here when you go live. Oh, yay. Maybe I'll start doing live streams around this time more often. Would you guys like that on YouTube? Okay, I will, Kaylee. Calm down. My neck never matches my face. Aw, Savvy, you should have come. That's okay. Next time. Alright, this is a different color bronzer. Let's see if it'll match up. You're triggered. I hate you. Um, aw. Aw, that's sweet. Honesty is truth said, Shani, I was hard on you. I watched your old videos, and I'm so sorry from my heart to yours. I love you, and my name is Juliet. You just made my whole day life thing. Thank you for saying that. That is, that's really awesome of you. I have so much respect for you. Thank you so much, really, I appreciate that. And welcome to the family. That's awesome, thank you. My sister says, do you wanna to go to the dollar store for lunch or dinner? I don't know why I'm doing this. There's nothing on here, I'm just, um, Sabrina said, what's on the brush? Why is it down your shirt? This one? Because I'm trying to bronze my chest in case I wear a v-neck. Is that a problem? Liner. Ooh. I'm good. Um...
So I'm going to ask a question so I can answer while I put this on, even though that's hard to do. It's hard to talk when you put mascara on. Mm. You can't breathe? Go to the hospital! Where's Danny? Danny's working in Springville still. Um, and he'll probably be working till like 10, 10.30 maybe. I was hoping he would get off early enough to take me out, but that's not gonna happen. Um, Dahlia Olive said, have you ever had a tan? How dark can you get? Okay. Well, um, I used to tan every day in high school. Oh my gosh, I just realized something. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so I used to tan every day in high school. And I got really tan. Uh, like, my family is very tan. My dad's side of the family is extremely tan. Like, my sister Angela, who's here, and my brother and my other sister, all of them tan in like 10 minutes, like gorgeous golden brown tan. Um, I don't anymore since I've been so sick. Uh, like over the past 10 years, I've gotten paler and paler and my skin doesn't absorb it and I also don't go in the sun a lot. So that's why I'm so pale and I'm anemic. <laughs> but um, in high school, I was very tan, but I would go tanning every day and like in a tanning bed. And I got a mole, I think it was this side, why am I forgetting? I think it was this, yeah, it was this side. I got a mole here and it kept getting darker and darker and blacker and blacker and they had to remove it because it was skin cancer. So it's true that you can get skin cancer from tanning. I can't talk and put this on at the same time. That's really hard to do. Um, Yeah, Dahlia, me too. She said it was super popular for people to tan in beds when we were in high school, me too. Back then, people weren't as cautious. And I'm too self-conscious to get a spray tan because I don't want anyone to see me. Um, Mackenzie Mindex says, which mascara do you use? Your lashes look lovely. Thank you. They'll look better in a minute after I put two more layers. Just CoverGirl Lash Blast. It's the best one, in my opinion. Especially when it's brand new. Um, okay, hold on. Okay, what? Mm. Oh my gosh. Um, Lila said, I used to tan because my ex liked it. I got a breast cancer tumor and I imagine that was a big part of it. Don't go tanning. I agree. It's so dangerous. Um... And the number of times I got burned, like severely burned, like sometimes I got boils from it. Like, it's dangerous if you do it too much. Um, I made you pee yourself? Why? What happened? You come pre-tan? Shut up, Haley. I hate you. You're lucky. Get this last layer on and then I'll talk to you. I promise. This is so interesting to watch, I'm sure. Okay, that's good enough. 
Okay. Oh yeah, Kelly Nietzsche said, Shani, have you heard about the Gardner Squad? They're in Utah and they have quads, two sets of twin girls. Yes, I have and I know her, I've met her. She, um, she was at the same conference that I spoke at last November um, and she's super, super sweet in person. Like she's just as nice. She's really cute. I've been trying to like reach out to her and maybe collab with her or something because she has endometriosis too. Like that's why, that's why they had to do so much to get their kids in vitro and stuff. Like she had it really bad, which I do too. So <laughs> someday I might hopefully get her to collab with me and talk about it. Yeah, you know, she's super sweet. And their videos are so cute. Those little girls are so freaking cute. Um. <laughs> Thanks, Jason. He said, please be careful when you use that needle so close to your eye, combing your lashes. Thank you, Jason. Technically, it's the back of an earring. And it's not that sharp, but I get what you're saying. I used to use safety pins. I would if I had one. You get enough practice that you get good, I promise. Like, I've never poked myself in the eye. Maybe in the skin, but not the ball. Um, really? <gasps> That's great, Julia. She said, I have one surviving child and I have terrible endometriosis. It can happen. Did you do like in vitro and stuff? That's so cool. Um... Aw, Noelle said, I've had a rough couple of days. I have to see my mom tonight, and I'm sad. I need a hug. Come on in. Come here. Come here. Come here. I love you. You can do this. Remember who you are and not what other people tell you that you are. And remember that it's okay to stand up for yourself and say how you're feeling. And it's important to recognize those feelings. And it's important that your loved ones recognize those feelings. And just remember to stay strong and that I believe you can do this. I believe in you. I love you. You will get through this. You will. And I love you. Mwah. There you go. Um, okay. It blows my mind when parents refuse to like understand what you're going through. That's really hard. Like, my mom didn't know what it was. Like, she didn't really realize what it was. And so, at first, she grounded me. But then she learned about it right away. And she's awesome and, like, takes the time to understand what I'm going through. Like, it blows my mind that so many of you tell your parents that you're struggling. And they don't, either they don't believe you or they don't think it's serious enough. Or they don't, they think you're just being dramatic or whatever. Like, that just, it just blows my mind. And it's sad, and I'm sorry so many of you have to go through that. It's not, it's not fair. It's not the right thing for a parent to do. So. Um. Okay, so I think I'm going to go, um... Um, but I'll take a couple more questions. Thanks, Jason. You too. Um... 
join your live when I leave, Sabrina? I might. Except I have so much to do. I probably might not, actually. I have so much to do. Um, Michelle Martin says, what do you use or suggest to do to cope with an eating disorder? Lots of things. <laughs> um, I've made videos on that. If you want to look it up, just look up like Shani coping with eating disorders. But the main thing that I always tell people that helps me the very most is to, um, yes, I put makeup on with my fingers, deal. The main thing I tell them that works the best for me is to serve other people. So, or get out of your own space, do something with or for somebody else. So like for me, that's why one of the reasons I started YouTube was to help other people. And I knew that that would take a lot of time and energy from me. And so it would make it harder to keep up an eating disorder. Um, and right now I'm using that greatly. I'm working extra hard on my videos right now. And that's my way. So whatever it is that you, um, that you can do, whether it's visiting an old person, um, go and volunteer somewhere, start a YouTube channel if you want. There's all kinds of stuff. Just get out of your own headspace and do something productive, either for yourself or for somebody else, like good things, you know. Um, let's see. Oh, thank you. Alexia says, wow, you're really pretty. Thank you. So are you. Um... Wait, what? Elise says, question, how do I re, oh, reintroduce binge trigger food without binging? Oh, I see. I read that wrong. How do you reintroduce binge food? Um, hmm. Wait, what? How do I reintroduce binge trigger food without binging? Okay. Um, I don't know. That's a tough one. For me, I've just been very slowly cutting back the amount that I eat of it. So, like, I eat like crap right now, and that needs to change. And I'm working on it, actually. I shouldn't say right now. I've been doing really great this week. Um, but I guess maybe until it stops triggering you, don't buy it, I guess. I don't know. That's hard to do. I know that, too. Um, I don't know. This is a tough one. I don't know. Maybe I'll think think this through even deeper and make a video about it. Let me write this down. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna make a video about that. That's a really good question. Um, Caitlin said, I self-harmed today after being clean for nearly a year. My boyfriend will be back in 45 minutes and I have no clue how to tell him. I'm sorry, sweetheart. You know what? This happens and don't be hard on yourself or you're just gonna wanna do it more. Um, just recognize it for what it was and move on and be honest with your boyfriend if you can't be honest with him ask yourself why that is um if he loves you he'll understand and he'll be there for you if you ask him to but you need to ask him to like you need to reach out okay let me take one more and then i'm gonna go <laughs> Let me pick, I'm trying to pick one that I haven't answered in a while. So everyone send in their questions and I'll pick one that I haven't answered in a while. <clears throat> hmm. 
Mm. <laughs> that's a good question, Dahlia. Wow, that's a really good one. Let's do that. Okay. Um, Dahlia said, who do you get your favorite features from? That is such an interesting question. So, um, my favorite feature, I guess my hair is one of them. And I get that from my mom. My dad is bald and went bald when he was like probably in his early 20s. Um, so I get that from my mom. She has really thick, beautiful hair. I also get the receding hairline maybe from my dad and maybe also eating disorder stuff, obviously. Um, and then my eyes, I like my eyes and I get my eyes from... The setting of my eyes is my dad. He has wide set eyes. My mom doesn't. She has closer set eyes. Um, but as far as like the color, I don't know. I think it's just both of them. They both have brown eyes. I can't, I can't remember which one has darker brown. I don't think either of them do. Like I have the darkest brown eyes in my family. Um, and then I don't really like anything. <laughs> I'll just tell you everything. Not that I like it. My lips, I get from, I think my mom, I think. My nose from the front looks like my dad and from the side looks like my mom, my mom's nose. Uh, my face, my big face comes from my dad. Um, what else? That's all I can think of. My teeth, I got my dad's looking teeth and my mom's health teeth. Like, she has really bad teeth naturally. Like, that runs in her family. You can't tell, but she's had so many tooth problems, and I'm sure that contributed to my tooth problems along with eating disorder. So, um, I have dimple thingies. What? I think the dimple things you have on the top, on the tip top of your cheekbones are adorable. Like, on the apples of your cheek. I've never, oh, I've never noticed that. Like these? Oh. Are those dimples or is that just like a continuation of my bags? I have never even noticed those before. Thanks for telling me that. That's sweet. I have lipstick on my teeth. Okay. I'm going to go. I got a lot to do. So <laughs> wish me luck. I hope I'll get the video up. I will try to get it up at least by midnight tomorrow, my time, Mountain Standard Time. So thanks, Dahlia. Thanks everybody for joining and I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow mm -hmm. and please pray if you do or send good thoughts because this is not an easy video to make. <laughs> All right. I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow. Remember forever and always that you are beautiful. You are worth it. And I am too. <gasps> Thank you for watching. Bye. Love you guys.